Hey everybody, welcome in. If this is your first video with me, welcome back if it is not. Either way, so excited that you're here and very grateful you've decided to spend just a little bit of your day with me today. Today we are doing a Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse Marvel Collector Core Box. Very unexpected, but very exciting. If you are just as excited as I am, let's get started, shall we? I'm Rachel. And this is Attainable Disney. This box showed up in a very unexpected way. I wasn't expecting it. I feel like it came very quickly after the Thor box. I don't know. It's supposed to be every other month. But I feel like they've been a little random I feel like sometimes it's like a few months in between boxes and then sometimes I feel like it's a few weeks so the idea is every other month but it does seem a, a wee bit random at sometimes I'm also surprised at this one because why I don't like the boxes are pretty on theme as far as like what they are promoting at the time this just feels random to me like are we, is there a Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse movie I didn't know about? I don't, I mean, like I'll take it, but it just feels like sort of out of left field. I don't know. I mean, whatever, right? You know, I mean, I had the perfect ears, right? Okay. So, um, here's what I tell you. I mean, I've seen the... Uh, into the Spider-Verse movie. I like it. I mean, I'm not like an expert on the Spider-Verse. Like I'm not an expert on the Spider-Verse outside of like the normal MCU. So I mean, I, I don't, hopefully this isn't too confusing. Okay, so here's the pin. I know. So this is Spider-Man 2099 one of the Spider-Mans in the Into the Spider-Verse movie. There's a Miles Morales decal. Uh, let's get into the two Funkos, which um, as uh, Lauren said when in the comment section as I was opening the Thor one, and I, I, I have to agree, he says the Funkos do tend to be the sort of most lackluster part of this box, which I do think he's right. Okay, oh, nice. Okay, so Funko number one is Spider-Gwen, which I was hopeful for a Spider-Gwen item. So that's cool. And then the other one is uh, Miles Morales, Spider-Man. And then my favorite part, which is the t-shirt. Oh, oh my God. I love that. Oh my gosh, Mike is going to love this because he really, really likes Into the Spider-Verse. Nice. I mean, I think as far as like relevance to the theme, I mean, I think all of these items are great. I don't, it's just like the theme is like not for me. Um, like, yeah, I mean, I just, the Spider-Verse thing is just, like, not my movie or whatever. Um, so I'm just, like, not, I don't know, I just, like, I'm not super duper excited about the theme. So it's just, like, hard for me to be, like, over the top excited. I really would have liked to see some of the Spider-Pig. <laughs> you know, like, the Spider-Pig that, like, John Mulaney voiced. I would have loved to see a spider pig pin or a spider pig sticker. Just saying. There is evidence that Miles Morales exists within our MCU, right? Within like the Earth 818 MCU. So I'll be interested to sort of see where that goes. 
We know that they're making the Madam Web movie. We'll see. I don't know. I don't have like super high hopes for that, but we'll see. We'll see. Like I said, relevant to the theme. I think these products are like spot on or whatever. It's just like not my theme. So I'm not like over the moon about it, but I do really like the t-shirt. I do really like the spider Gwen. I was hoping for a spider Gwen thing. Um, it does say the next box is Wakanda forever, which super excited about that. So we are just, just really a couple weeks away from uh, Wakanda forever, which feels weird to say. I feel like we've been waiting for years, but just a couple weeks away from Wakanda forever. So very excited. Uh, which like, I feel like this should have been the Wakanda forever box, I, whatever. So now like the Wakanda forever box is going to come in two months, like after the movies come out. So I, this is what I'm saying when it doesn't make sense. But that's fine. So for $29.99, we got two Funkos, a t-shirt, a, a pin, and a sticker. If you really like Across the Spider-Verse, then this would probably be really exciting for you. I feel very neutral. Let me know what you guys think. Of course, the link will be below if you're interested in subscribing. Um, at least this one did not come chewed up like the Thor one did. So I got that going for me, right? Okay. Let me know what you guys think, what your thoughts are. Do you have a theory as to why they sent this box? Because it feels very random to me. Do you have a theory? I'm open. Okay. All right, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.